So on a bigger project, right here would be where our generators lie. We have our generators so we can charge our battery so our drones can run all day. Next, we have our two totes. One tote holds water and then the other will hold our chemical product. Before we start, we'll have a set list of how much product needs to go in there and the exact mathematical equation of what products need to go in there at what quantity. And we'll use that with our hose here to fill up our drone and that will get keep us going really fast. Then next, we have our battery compartment here. We keep our batteries nice and even so then it's very easier for my dad to come grab them and go so we can keep going at a nice rate. Then we have our staircase, which will lead up to our higher level. And up at this higher level, I have my seat where I'll be able to watch over our field and be able to watch over where I need to look and look at the drone while it's going. The first year we did it, we did it off of a utility trailer, a tandem actual utility trailer. We didn't have a flight deck or anything. Kind of midway through the growing season, through that fungicide and insecticide window. And we knew going into our second season, we had to do something a little bit different than that. So that's when I uh, kind of got a hold of Jonathan. Uh, it's kind of a kind of a jack of all trades. He, he's a good welder, he's a good, he can, he can kind of see a, a project that I wanted. And, and he knew exactly what I was wanting to do and how to fulfill what I, what my vision was on that. And so that's when we brought Jonathan in. Jonathan uh, helped build the trailer, so we have a flight deck now for our second season. We had a flight deck. So me and him came up with the idea to use an existing trailer we had. We built a top that sets on it. We had little tanks and stuff in the bottom to fill up with, and we can set up top and fly and watch drones as they go across the field. You gotta help out senior citizens. I'm yeah, out there. Exactly. <laughs> So for Jonathan, um, I wasn't so much involved with the building of the trailer. My husband and I actually teach agriculture together, and so my husband runs the shop. And I know that Jason is his name. I know Jason worked with Jonathan hand in hand um, and letting him have some shop time to work on that project as well. And whenever he took it to the state fair, I know my husband was very proud of how that ended up turning. 